Hey now, I'm Dorian, joined by my wife and celebrity menswear stylist, Ashley Weston. Hello, hello. Fellas, today we are talking about the best swim trunks, swimsuits, whatever the hell you want to call them, <laughs> swimwear, swimwear. <laughs> whatever, for men. It's been asked, so it is now, Ashley, time, time. to answer that question, the yeah. age old question, what swim trunks work for you? Hopefully you've already seen how your swim trunk should fit and what to look out for in those. We just released that video not too long ago. We'll link that in the description below so you can check it out first so you understand what you're looking for. Yep. And then these are some of Ashley's absolute favorite picks. So Ash, what is your first choice of okay. your favorite swim trunks this So year? my first pick is actually by H&M. It's these floral shorts. I think that you should have, like with swimwear, with swim trunks, you can have fun with it. So some people prefer solids, uh, subtle designs, but I, I I also really love just a fun design like a Hawaiian kind of floral print. Um, these ones are a five inch uh, length or inseam, which five inches hits around mid thigh, just so you guys know. But these ones are a cotton blend. Um, they, which actually kind of means that they're on the thinner side, which can be a little problematic. Kind of like running shorts is the best way yeah. I would describe them as far as the thickness of the material, if you know what that means. Yeah, so when you get out of the pool, they do have a tendency to stick. Stick to <laughs> items and create outlines. Yeah, which is can be a little annoying, but that's also why I chose a print, because if you're gonna have a thinner fabric and with like the elastic waistband that's all the way around with the drawstring front. Do these come in like a solid color as well? They actually? do come in a solid okay. color. I personally really love this floral print. It, there is kind of a retro vibe to it. It's it's fun and I love the coolness of the turquoise color. It's gonna complement any skin color yeah. out there, whether you are pale or super tan or dark, doesn't matter. It's It'll gonna complement you and it's gonna look really fresh. It's a great price. Again, pick them up. If you have an inkling that you want these, they will go quickly. The H&M and kind of the fast fashion companies, you got about a week or two before they're basically gone forever. So if you like them, check out the link in the description below for our article. And again, if you want those in solid colors, they also come in solid colors. Okay, Ash, so that was our budget-friendly option. Yep. What do we have that maybe is a little more of a step up from that? Okay, so I have these ones by Banana Republic. They have a zigzag print design. It's very classic, timeless, super retro, like, like 50s, almost like 50s, 60s, 60s vibe, yeah, yeah. which I love. Like, if you're gonna do a print um, or a pattern, excuse me, if you're gonna do a pattern, I love when it's like a 50s, 60s design. It always looks good year after year after year. But anyway, so with these ones, um, they are, they, they're a polyester blend, um, which they're still gonna be on the thinner side, but what I love about these swim trunks is that they actually, the design, so this is my favorite design for swim trunks. It's where it has the fly with the snap closure, so it almost looks like you're wearing a pair of shorts, um, so it looks great in and out of the pool. I always love when you're, I, like, especially with swimwear, when they can kind of function both ways, like, you know. Yeah, they also have, Banana Republic actually has quite a few good selections on patterns. However, I think there is a caveat Stripes. What do you think okay. about big, bold stripes? Yes. Can I please say this? If you are, okay, if you're going to choose something that has a pattern or print to it, the only thing I don't like are horizontal stripes, especially in the crotch area. But any horizontal stripes, stay away from them. They're really unflattering. They draw attention to your hips um, and not in a flattering way. So if you are going to do stripes, just make sure they're vertical. And small. Um, and small. Yeah, like micro small. I don't yep. care how wide you are, you still want them small. Okay. Um, but yeah, that's my I wanted to bring up that point because I saw that Banana Republic had a couple options like that. I was like, mm, no. I don't no think No horizontal stripes. Like yeah. Okay. Moving on. Okay, so my final favorite swim trunks are by... But before you do that, there are some other options <laughs> we are linking in the article, linked in the description below. These are three that Ash really likes, but there's actually quite a few others. We don't want to make this video crazy long yep. for... It's not really necessary. So check them out, linked in the description below. Anyways. So I wanted to include something that was kind of more of a solid color. This has like a micro, micro, micro stripe, but it's a solid color. So these ones are by Onia. They're um, more expensive. However, they're made out of a stiffer fabric, which is actually ideal. So it's, I mean, that's what you want in a swim trunk. A good quality swim trunk will always be made out of stiffer fabric. Stiffer and maybe even a little thicker yeah, as well. Yeah, a little so thicker. So it holds more 
structure. Yes, and it's going to lay flatter against the skin. And most importantly, when you get out of the pool, you don't have that suction <laughs> to your genitals problem. You like won't have thinner. that at all, okay, at all. So when you spend a little bit of more money, and uh, you know, and with this brand in particular, it, it is a thicker fabric, so I do like that. Also, it's in my favorite design for swimwear for you guys. Um, it has the fly with the snap closure. Um, and it's just like this really retro blue color. I love this color because it's very refreshing. In the I swim know. trunk world, I've noticed I've owned very budget-friendly options, mid-level and high-end. High-end ones I have for five plus years. Go down the line and go to the more budget-friendly and that maybe will make it through a year, a season, a season we'll say. one season. Um, so you kind of get what you pay for. So if you're really looking for the cream of the crop, it will last you a good amount of time. And I would argue you'll probably get more money's worth out of a higher-end option than you will more budget-friendly option. So take that with a grain of salt. Obviously budgets determine everything at the end of the day. But if you're really looking to amortize the cost of your swim trunks, I'm going on five years on a pair that were about a hundred dollars like that too. More 150 that, yeah, yeah sorry yeah. sorry yeah Closer but to that. this is what i will say i personally think look if you want to have those fun kind of crazy prints don't spend very much money on those yeah but for a good classic pair yep. good timeless pair you should spend the money and it's going to last you like five plus years and again fellas it's super important how your swim trunks fit you so you don't want to get these and look like a schlub and it's like, well, you just wasted all your money anyway. So linked in the description in our article as well are how your swim trunk should fit. This one gets very particular about exactly the details of how they should fit for all body types. So definitely check it out. Guys, that's it. Hopefully you liked it. Link some of your favorites in the description below as, or in the uh, comment section below. We'd love to see if maybe we missed some and there's some really high quality swim trunks out there that we just didn't know about. So, fellas, check out my article. <laughs> obviously, check out the article for all the pics, plus a couple extras as well. Thumbs if you liked this video, subs if you loved it. We'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye. Bye.